I went antiquing today. Oh my god. It was so much fun. Extremely happy with this. I had to get this. All right. Oh, I forgot. I have a couple more things. I have a couple more things I need to show you guys. and I also do uh, handyman work as far as gazebos, uh, light, light fixes at home, furniture assembly and things of that nature. I might need you in the future for another project. <laughs> yeah, just let me know. Just let me know if you got any other light fixtures or anything like that. Uh, just give me a call. If you need some furniture assembly like chairs, couches, um, any backyard items, sheds, and gazebos. I got a team of guys. Um, I know some painter as well, so. Oh, that's right. excellent. Yeah, right. excellent. Okay, I appreciate that. All right. All right. Bye -bye. All right, guys. All right, guys. All right, y'all should have been listening to the whole conversation. I I don't never record it like when I need to be recording, but this morning my um my light fixture was supposed to be put up, and I went through the Wayfair Angie list process, but in that process they only have two options to pick from. They want to know if you have like either a nine foot ceiling or like an 11 to 15 foot ceiling. And mine is like 20 feet. So the contractor, he, uh, well, the professional, he called me, he asked me those questions and I told him. So then he was like, I'm not gonna be able to come out, but it's okay. It'll happen Monday. It'll finally happen Monday. The hubs is still not feeling good. I need to do my hair and I don't know what I'm gonna do today today is Saturday I don't know if I want to go out and do any shopping I don't think I I don't think I do that's crazy it's payday and I'm like I don't even want to go do any shopping isn't that something what that is growth <laughs> babe what is wrong with you I know you're sick but dang like you feel worse than yesterday? Mm hmm Yeah, I'm still congested and stuff. <clears throat> Body aches and stuff. You know, you know like, I'd be happy. I mean, I'm, I'm sick. <laughs> <laughs> you <would> be happy. <laughs> happy Sunday. Yes, it's Sunday today. And I have some packages here from Amazon. Don't get too happy because they're not, it's not a big deal, really. So I ordered a light fixture that will be here tomorrow for my bathroom. I'm excited about that. Can't wait for that to get here. And the rest of this is just nothing spectacular. So, all right. So I know you guys have heard of Tabitha Brown. She has partnered up with McCormick and they have this salt-free seasoning. But I was like, I need to try this. Saute Business by Tabitha Brown Salt Free. I'm going to try this out. And I hope I like this because I'm looking for like a solution to this salt situation. Let's see what it smells like. Oh, it smells good. It might be all right. You know what I'm saying? I like McCormick seasoning anyways. This might be okay. This was a set and I don't like pineapple. So I doubt I will be using this one. This has garlic, ginger, pineapple, and mango in it. This one is called sunshine. This has garlic, onion, turbinado sugar. I don't know what that paprika. Oh, it smells so lovely. God, we. This smells delicious. This 
it is very smoky it's very strong it's very very strong all right and then here's another one this one is called very good garlic garlic black pepper and lemon this is probably going to be my go-to seasoning because these are the seasonings that I use anyway oh my gosh Ooh, packed with so much flavor I can tell oh my goodness I can tell this one is going to be super good <laughs> but yo I'm going to check out Tabitha Brown see what she's working with and um, maybe that is the solution to this salt situation keep you posted so it's 12 o'clock there are two places that I want to go today. The first place I want to go to is this antique mall. Um, I'm going to go in there. I'm probably not going to film. I'm just curious to see what kind of Halloween they have. Or maybe even Christmas. So that's what I'm looking for in there. And then, of course, I'm going to go to Home Goods. $17 for him. Cleaning gloves are in the wrong area. We got some dish towels over here. They're, they got cats on them. Okay. And then we have this baby right here. $17 for this. Here is like the little match that goes with it. It's $8. Super, super cute. Um, let's see how much it is. $17 for that baby right there. I already saw this before, right? But the Ravens are kind of popular. $30 for that and then I saw this on somebody's channel right there for $20 it was pretty cool look at these little houses over here this one's for $30 I think they're both no they're different so this one is like $25 for that one but yeah lots um lots of dishware over here as well this right here is like $8 so here's another house right here smaller you could like put them all together and make like a little village and it is i don't know how much it is <laughs> but that's right there a doll by nicole miller is 25 dollars these little cones look at that it's like a little witch hat right there then here's this one is actually it is a witch hat Get that at the bottom yeah this is what's happening here today I like these though these are so cute candelabra is still here so it's still here surprisingly that's still here right here is $40 for this. this little witch little sign right here for $13 not sure but this caught my eye I don't know why it's $10 kind of weird looking you know what I mean um like in this for $15 $30 for this the cat is $13 kind of busy out I always felt like these were so cool right here so cool spoon rest in the bath right there we got some little little jars over here little containers All right, I'm back in the radon section and they still have quite a few of those mugs here. Football season, quite a few of those. I don't see the ones with the coffee on them though. The ones with the like invisible writing, you know what I'm talking about? Those are gone. Check these out for $5. Those are pretty, right? All right. Have I showed this to you already before? I don't know if I've shown this to you before. This is $17. That one. Here's a pretty orange tablecloth. This is different. First time seeing this. This is pretty. $40 for this. It's like a European um, collection going on over here. Really do like this pillow though. It's really, really pretty. They have others. I think, yeah, they have another one over here too. It's got like the hound's tooth pattern to it. That's really, really pretty. Look at these. I love these. Gorgeous. Oh my gosh. They have this one. $8 for that. And then they have these over here. 
these over here are the gorgeous but i kind of like the darker ones though i love that pillow though for 40 dollars lots of pretty florals over base. here this one is popping out to me that. i like the vase too see how much it costs here's another one over here 40 dollars for that it's a floral arrangement those are pretty now, this is a pretty vase right here. I like that. That's really, really pretty. $25. That's not bad. It's really, really gorgeous. All right. Oh, these are pretty right here. Look at this one. I like this. This is so cute. This is $13, by the way. Super cute. Love that. These towels right here. These are nice. $10 for those. Right. Also, this one right here is here, too. I kind of like this as well. $13 for that. So I went antiquing today. It was so much fun. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it was so much fun. I spent so much time in there. I must have spent like two hours in there. There was just so much to look at, right? But let me show you what I got. So I got two of these lamps. I thought they were gorgeous. And they're actually for my guest bedroom up there because the other day I was up there and I was getting ready to like start decorating for Halloween and I realized that like something was missing like I needed some really good lamps and I looked and I looked and I looked and I could not find anything at the last minute at the very last minute they were like on the bottom if I hadn't walked past and just turned my head looked down like that I would have missed them I got them both for $65 and I love the detail I love the detail on this it's so gorgeous Oh my gosh. I'm very happy with this purchase. Um, very, 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 very happy with this. Extremely happy with this. So anyways, what's so crazy is I was in there and they had these voodoo dolls. But before I saw the voodoo dolls, I felt like something bit me. Something bit my toe or something like there was something going on up in there. Spiders or something was biting me. <laughs> I turned around and saw some voodoo dolls and I was like, oh my God. When I was in Home Goods, I saw this pillow and fell in love with it. It almost reminds me of like a tapestry. It's very, very beautiful. Can you see the details on this? It's gorgeous. That's what it looks like in the front. Very, very beautiful and European looking and it even feels like that and then the back is like this gorgeous i love it i had to get this um how much was this it was 40 dollars. yeah it was 40 dollars, but i felt like it was worth it like this was something i was looking for i got this candle holder because it was it's eight dollars but yo it looked so freaking cute and it was from the same line as this pillow all right so got these so i love to see like little witchy things hanging up on side of the refrigerator i feel like it's so much fun you know so this was only three dollars All right, so I got two more things from the antique mall and I went back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. One piece I knew right away that I had to have it, but the other piece I just waited until I like walked the whole store and then I finally was like, I can't leave out of here without that. And I'm going to show you what it is. Isn't it so pretty? Oh my gosh. It reminds me of the light covers that I just bought for my um my kitchen area. Yo, this is so pretty. I love this. I love this. And I love the fact that it was only I think this was only like yo, I hate when they take the tags off, but I think this was like four dollars. I don't know. 
why I had to have this other than the fact that I love flowers but and look at this it matches so well I didn't even I didn't even realize that like I like what I like and I know it when I see it like when I see it right away it's like that I love that I love flaw I love flowers I love pinks I mean I don't even know how much this was because they didn't took the tags off of everything but it wasn't that much I can tell you that much probably about like not even twelve dollars maybe twelve dollars if that but this is what it looks like I just was I just had to have it because it's just too pretty to leave there I'm I'm like it had to come home with me the only thing I have left are groceries so I need to put my groceries away I'm gonna fix me something to eat real quick saute me some veggies with this type of the brown saute seasoning it better be good because baby <laughs> I got high expectations for her. I will definitely let you know how it turns out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.